This question describes a digital communication system where we have a sampling clock operating at 16.2 kilohertz. We have a 20-bit ADC or a 20-bit quantizer. And we're given the peak-to-peak -peak voltage of the signal. So the signal has a peak-to-peak -peak voltage of 12 volts and we're allowed to assume that the quantizer has a dynamic range that matches that 12 volts so that's the range of the quantizer and there are a number of questions that were asked about this so first question is what is the sampling period so the sampling period is the reciprocal of the sample rate. The sample rate is the clock that's given there. So Ts is just 1 over Fs. So it's just 1 over 16.2 thousand. That's 61.7 microseconds. How many quantization levels are permitted? So that's basically L. So we're given the number of bits, 20 bits, and that gives us L because L is simply 2 to the power n or 2 to the power 20. Okay, so if you calculate that, that's just over a million. It then says, what's the quantizer step size? So, what's the size of the individual step there? So, to find the step size, that's related to two things. It's related to the dynamic range, in this case 12 volts, and it's related to the number of levels. So that delta is the peak-to-peak -peak value or the dynamic range divided by the number of levels. So here it would be 12 divided by 2 to the power 20. Twelve divided by two to the power twenty, and the answer is eleven point four microvolt. Now, if each step size is eleven point four microvolt, what's the maximum quantizer error? The, the error, the quantizer error, can never be. Um, we can assume for uniform quantizers it won't be more than half of that. So it'll be 11.4 over 2. So it's 5.7 microvolt. So we can calculate um, the um, maximum quantizer error by finding the step size of the quantizer and then simply dividing by two. So that is your final answer.